But all of these platforms are good and I encourage people to use them. Um, but use them with, you know, if LLMs can hallucinate. In other words, they can just generate information that's not entirely correct, but it just seems and sounds correct. And so there is, you do need to double check, which is why I love Notebook LM. You can ask it to put the actual source on the screen and you can verify the fact for yourself. Um, and I find that an excellent safety net. Um, I, I think I, I would say verification is one thing and glenn is right on 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 track with saying that he verifies his results from chat gpt statistical analysis by having it generate python which he loads into google collab i find that um the, the more the more ai different ai tools you use to carry out the same task the less likely there are to be errors so i for instance would give chat gpt a task and give the exact same task to gemini um, and compare the result, or I would get my response from ChatGPT and put that response and question into Gemini and ask for Gemini's opinion about, you know, Interesting. The, the, there was a whole back and forth between both of them on how to, the step-by-step -step, uh, to carry out the test. <laughs> so that was interesting to see because it, it made it more obvious to me why it's important to cross-check and not allow yourself to be spoon-fed by AI. And I think that you are less likely to be tripped up if you use these tools often but cautiously and get good at using them and that's a lovely little trick where you get one ai to kind of double check another um i, I think that's quite clever i think that and the, 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 these are the sorts of things that we need to start getting good at 